The National Health Insurance Scheme is meant to provide a comprehensive health care services from primary through secondary to tertiary levels. But since 2005, when the scheme started, only a small percentage of Nigerians have been covered compared to the nation's population. The development is partly attributed to the inability of NHIS to integrate the informal sector, which has a larger population. Guests on Good Morning Nigeria attributed other factors affecting access to quality health care to inadequate funds and infrastructure. They stressed the need for review of the law establishing the scheme while advocating increase in the number of primary health care providers and timely payment of required funds. Now, funding for this care is provided by the British government. You don't pay any money into the cost, but the cost comes from the general taxation. The scheme should grow from 4% to about 50%, even let's say 20%. Then from there we can, you know, jump it up. Apart from malaria and typhoid and a few other things, if you go to the hospital with serious conditions, you're just wasting your time. Having an effective taxation system, the guests believe will make the scheme work optimally and called for prompt payment of contributions to enhance service delivery. NHIS have contracted with the HMO that for these 200 lives, you can only access them if you go and register. It's the number you register. Maybe for one reason, the first month, you register about 120,000. NHIS say, well, I will still only pay you for those numbers that are entered into my system. So at the end of the day, maybe about 40 people are entered into the system. So you can imagine you are paying for 200, 160 of that people are disenfranchised, their money is kept in the reserve. Because studies have been done to show that out of the 1,000 that have chosen it, not more than 30% will visit in any particular month. And he earns the money. He doesn't need to refund it to the scheme. That's capitation. The guests are optimistic that the scheme will achieve its desired goal with necessary review and commitment on the part of all key players. In Abuja, Aisha Uba'ali, NTA News.